Welcome to the second video in a series of Second Life tutorials from NCTT, the National Center for Telecommunications Technologies. In this video, we're going to download and install the Second Life client, and then sign into the world for the first time. Remember that you've received an email from Second Life when you first activated your account. Just follow the link in the email with your web browser, and once that page is up and running, just click on the download and install Second Life client link. You will be prompted to either run or save the application. I chose to save it. Remember the location that you saved it to and leave the close this dialog box when download completes unchecked. When the download is complete, hit the run button and then run again. Choose your language for install and note the installation notes. Follow the default prompts to install the program. You can either start Second Life now or not, and if you choose not to, you can start it from your desktop with the shortcut icon. Sign into the world with the username and password that you established when you first signed on to the website, and then the world will load in. Note that if you don't have an updated version of QuickTime, some multimedia content will not be available until you update your Apple QuickTime component. We first land at Orientation Island. This is where you can learn some basic skills about interacting with your avatar in the world, learn how to move, edit your appearance, use your inventory items, and communicate with other people in world. In our next video, we will follow these tutorials and get you up to speed in working in Second Life.